Hey everyone, I'm Master Tran, the co-founder of Transcend Lifestyle. Don't just live, rise above. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about TOMA. T-O-M-A. It stands for Top of Mind Awareness. Now I learned this concept many years ago in uh, advertising, in marketing, where they ask you to, uh, you know, to, to advertise in the newspaper over and over again. The, the philosophy is that, you know, you don't just advertise once because not everyone will see it, but you advertise consistently, people will eventually will see it. Well, I want to apply this Toma philosophy in our life, um, the top of mind awareness. How's your Toma in your nutrition? How's your Toma in your training? And how's your Toma in your life? What I mean is this. Let's talk about your nutrition. Top of mind awareness of nutrition. Do you know, and a lot of people, even I train, or personal train and teach on a yearly basis and coach, you know, I ask people, you know, do you know what you goes through your mouth every day, what you're eating? And most of them, of course, say, yeah, I mean, you probably say the same thing. Oh, yeah, I know what I'm eating every day. I just ate this yesterday. But what I really mean, uh, mentally, do you know what's going through your mouth on a daily basis and what's doing to you? An easy way to think about this or to do this is uh, journalize. I challenge you to even a week of just writing down everything that goes through your mouth from the time you wake up to the time you go to bed. Everything goes through your mouth, liquids, anything you put through your mouth for one week. And I want you at the end of the week, go back and take a look at it. I, I guarantee you, most of you will be shocked when you read your journal, what's going into your mouth, okay? So that's what I mean by top of mind awareness. See, a lot of people say, I eat good, but you know what? That's just the thing they say to themselves because they want to feel good. But when top of mind awareness with your nutrition means you know exactly what's going in your mouth, but more importantly, you know exactly what's doing to your body. That's Toma, right? What about Toma in your training? Some of you might, might say, you know, I have been plateauing and seeing results. Well, part of it also is that look at your training. Take a step back. Look at your training last week. What did you like about what you didn't like? Maybe you weren't aware that there's certain days that you came in, you didn't give 110%. You didn't put it all out there on the line. Or maybe you just don't enjoy the workout anymore. Or maybe you need something new to change it up to shock the system. So be aware of how you're working now. Even the workout itself, when it comes to, like, example, strength training, you know, focus on the muscle that you're working out because it'll work it even more. Right? Instead of looking around other people as you're lifting, you know, you're, not, you're there for the wrong reason. So top of mind awareness in your strength training or just in your training in general. What about this? Toma in your life. You know, somebody once said to me that um, forget about the robber that robs you in the alley. What about the, the robber that robs of your mind every day on a daily basis? I want you to stand guard at the gate of your mind. You know, and be careful what you put in there. Do you know what's you putting in to your mind daily? How maybe guys are putting a positive deposit into that emotional, mental bank account daily. And how much of that is being withdrawn from you? If there's more withdrawal than there are positive deposit, you're in trouble. You know what that means? You're in the red and you're negative. So what are you doing right now, you know, to work on your Toma in your life? My encouragement to you is always to read good books. Listen to audio tapes. Read good magazines out there, like Success Magazine with Darren Hardy. All right? Great books. I'm a big believer in reading books or listening to audio tape. Working on net time, not enough time. Listing that in your auto university. When you're in your car, put that in and listen to it. How about surrounding yourself with positive people? That's Toma. Sometimes you're just around negative people. You only notice it that they're dragging you down. All right? So how about changing your environment? You know, changing your environment and choosing the right people that you want to be around that's going to help you grow and you're going to help them grow too. So anyways, 
just my thought for today. And uh, so how's your Toma for the year so far? Top of mind awareness. Keep an eye on that. Keep track of that. The easy way to do this is journal it. And you know what I'm talking about. You know your weak points and you know your strong point. The gap analysis, right? All right, guys. I encourage you every day to live your life with faith, passion, and purpose. Take care and God bless.